The folks here just at work finished up and I had an interesting case I just wanted to share with you a couple of clips on this quick tutorial on bending endo sequence scout files. So uh, some of the times when you have a small access preparation and, and uh, you have teeth and patients that have limited access or rather limited openings, what you want to do is you want to use, you want to pre-bend your heat treated files. Here in this case with the endo sequence scout files, the trick is you try to um, kind of bend it with the back of the mirror. You can even use your finger with a clean hand, obviously. But a little trick that I use oftentimes, with those other previous methods, the amount of bending is limited uh, because of the heat that is present in your hand as you're doing it or even the room temperature. But what ends up happening is if you actually take an alcohol gauze and then bend it with the alcohol gauze, the, as the alcohol evaporates from the surface of the file very quickly, it chills it and it cools it and that cooling effect will actually enhance the uh, martensitic properties of the material and therefore you get more pre-bending by using the alcohol gauze than you would do with the use of your the back of the mirror or with your fingers so that was a little trick that i wanted to show you on this case of uh, this uh, maxillary molar that i just did which i thought was uh, going to be helpful for you and the comment below see if you have any other tricks yourself that you use for pre-bending the files that are not you know, too complicated and are probably more real world endo. All right, for real world endo, I'm Ali Nisse, and let's save some teeth.